was working $9.50 an hour and I had to pay bills, pay rent, buy food, take care of my daughter. A lot of things fell through. I was really afraid that they were, probably would take her away from me because she shouldn't be left alone at age eight, you know. When I think of the work of FCA, I think about the lives that have been changed and the children who are going to be growing up in a way that is dramatically different than they would have been growing up if it wasn't for the work of the staff of FCA. FCA is a family. You can see as a student looking at the staff that they care for each other very deeply and that transfers over to the students. They didn't just treat each other as a family, they treated the students as their family too. At FCA we provide an array of services to children and families and adults and seniors. Adoption services both domestically and internationally mental health and substance abuse services, support to families through our family development programs where we provide parental guidance and support. We provide services to the homeless and we work with seniors through in-home homemaker services and live-in care. When I think of the work that we do here at FCA and I think of the clients and the young people that we have an incredible impact on. I think of a, a young person who comes into our Aspire program in sixth grade, struggling in school, unable to really get the work done with a whole host of issues that they may be dealing with both in the school and in their home. I came here as an immigrant when I was eight years old, and at the time I didn't really know how to read and I was getting bullied in school. At Aspire, many of our students have what's called an opportunity gap, and they're not exposed to things that, one, help their brains develop and offer them other things that they can be successful in. She's very shy. The program helped her to have that courage, confidence. that confidence. Mm -hmm. Education is important, and that's what they do at FCA. They tell you that, you know what, in order to you reach your goals, education is important. When I joined Aspire, they taught me how to love reading, and they gave me the confidence. And now I'm graduating high school and getting an associate's degree and going on to university to become a surgeon. In the last 13 years, I've watched Aspire grow from a drop-in center at the library to a program that serves 140 children from 6th grade through 12. For me, the great and wonderful part is that we get them for 7 years, 12 months a year, so we really can help them achieve their goals and their dreams and support their families, and it's beyond anything I ever thought that we could do when we first started. In Aspire, I am most grateful for the lessons that they have taught me. If I didn't have Aspire, I definitely wouldn't understand how to navigate life as I do now. Without these skills, I don't think I'll be able to succeed. It truly is remarkable when we can see that we are changing lives, we're building lives, and we really are working towards that ultimate vision of a thriving community of empowered individuals and, and healthy families. I'm so grateful to the donors. A lot of them haven't met me personally, but they're helping real people, kids just like me. You know, I came from parents who weren't able to read and write, so it was, she's a first generation for us who has surpassed that. You know, she coming here is like a blessing in the time when we did. She would not have been here. She, we would not have all of this. I would not have been here now where I am, you know. Yeah, a lot of support. 
Alles super.